Smile. For those of you who don't know what this game is, it's a game filled with random objects and models designed to confuse anyone who plays it. However, behind the randomness and behind the complexity, there are secrets for you to unlock. You find keys to open doors that spawn to explore more of what this odd horror game has to offer. But today we aren't here to find the keys. We're here to find more of the weirdest badges on this platform. Now that I've said that, I welcome you to Smile Badge Hunt 2. Let's just get the red and yellow keys and then I'll meet you at the back rooms. I love this part, let's go! <laughs> Making all that noise, guys. Oh, there we go. Got the, got the key. Oh! It's not like it was sauce. <laughs> Why the frick did they look up like that? Right, let's climb up here and then let's get the mirror and the black key. <laughs> Actually, no. Somehow, in my first episode of the series, the Badge Hunt series, I forgot to show you a badge that is extremely obvious, but I didn't get it. So I'm going to get it now and I'm going to show you what it is. So you go down these three paths. Not this one. Not this one. Not- Yes, this one actually. No, I'm-, I'm Okay, ignore that. And yeah, I'll see you at the end. Oh, finally. Alright, so. Not only from here can you get the first key card, but also if you step in this room, you get a badge. I didn't say it in the bottom right like always because I've already got the badge but I can show you what the badge looks like in post so as you can see that's what the badge looks like and yeah anyways back we go right, that took a while anyways so the next badge we have to get is gonna be in the vaults over there so let's first get the mirror which uh, we actually don't have to go over there for see I've discovered a way to uh, cheat the game a little bit It's not hacks, but uh, it's a very, it's a useful, it's very useful, very useful. Occasionally you get it, and then you can go straight through. It's not hacks, by the way, it's just, it's just, you know. There should be an info card leading to the way I did this, so uh, click it if you want to know how I did this glitch. Anyways, so let's get the black key, and let's go back. The finger of God. Where are the hands of God? Before we go through the black key door, I have some footage from a YouTube channel called Speezy Speedrunning that I'd like to show you. You see that? The hands of God? You know what it is also called the hands of God? This badge right here, one yesterday, zero, one ever, 210, compared to a nearly impossible badge that only 320 people have got, meaning that this is even more difficult than this badge, which is very difficult, okay? It's very difficult. Anyways, so we're going to go through the black key doors. So we've got the first key card here. And it let me in by the hairs of my chinny chin chin work. Alright, so this, let's be careful again. I'm gonna go really fast and 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 I'm gonna wear a mask. <clears throat> Alright, let's see if I can actually get the Gektri badge. So, uh, yeah, let's go through. Also, when I've found absolutely everything there is to be found in Smile, you guys could leave some more games to find stuff in, in the comments. That would be pretty awesome. Let's see if I can climb the tree. Nope, not it. 
Let's actually make sure we haven't missed any <laughs> anything. Hold on, let's stop the video there again. You know why? Because the YouTuber who made the Hands of God video? They've seen more stuff. He commented on the same video. Guys, I posted some more Roblox Smile content on Game Jolt, such as badge tutorials, search for Turnip Power, his cat name. So I searched it up, and lo and behold, he's found more stuff. Now I've seen all of this, right? But I have never seen the Hands of God thing. And I've never, I don't know how to get to it. But maybe in the separate video about this, I'll find it. And while I was on his profile, I found this. And it reads, I'm gonna try and read it far so you don't get bored. <laughs> hey guys, so there's a big confusion on how to get the get you better, Robert Smiler. How do you get it doing from a very difficult bug or the tree until you reach the little part? So basically, we have to get up there. Past the trees we go. And bada bing, bada boom, kapa- Ah, oh, I timed it wrong. Bada bing, bada boom, ka Any moment now, please. There we go. Okay. So we have to get up there. Up there. Up there! Sorry, so we have to do hard parkour. Now, I don't know if you've seen on my channel, but I've made quite a lot of obby themed videos. So I'm sure it's not going to be that hard. possible but you know I'm not gonna give up until it's been 15 minutes of me just jumping up this tree aimlessly this just let me on in the next five seconds I don't even know what I'm gonna do okay I give up I actually give up I can't do that I'm stumped I, I'm not no there's no way that's too difficult too difficult. We're gonna go to where the purple key area is and we're gonna see if we can get the Leche badge. Let's go. Oh, finally we're out. But yeah, as I was saying, let's go to the purple key area and let's see if we can get this badge. trip here but you know let's see what happens no! all right so I gave up on the purple key badge and now we're in the teal key area so well we're not in the teal key area we just went past the teal key door yeah, we're gonna get a badge that's actually really close to here, and I'll show you exactly where it is. So instead of going however many eyes and just jumping down there to get to the orange key area, we actually keep on going along the path of eyes. And boom. So, as you can see, this is a weird area, I'm not gonna lie. Hope this doesn't give any epileptic people a seizure, because otherwise... That would not be very good, but yeah, we're at the baby, we're at the sacrificial baby fountain, which is a badge. What's up there? Well, I guess we'll never know, but subscribe to that. No, okay, no, I'm sorry. While I'm here, I'm gonna enable click to move, and then, yeah, let's get to the, let's get to the orange key. get the orange key. Actually, before we get the orange key, let's get the broom first. Nice, nice. So now we've opened that door, let's go through the red key, red door. Not the red key door, what? Let's go up here. It's a bit worrying how much I remember in this game, but you know moving rapidly on. <laughs> Climb past these buildings. Let's click on this guy's hat. We don't really need to know what he's saying, do we? Let's go through the wonderful world of the hat key door. 
we go. Seven doors down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If I'm correct, gotta smash that like button. I was wrong. Let's go back here. And boom. I was one off, okay? That means you're one uh, away from clicking the like button and subscribing. Please. I'm sorry for the self promotion, but you know it would. You know it would. Now let's exit. This this is weird. And also, let me show you the cool part. Look how cool that shape is. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I don't know, you know, I'm going full graphics. It looks exactly the same, but still. Like, look at that. You can't tell but that's not mesmerizing. I hope this didn't put any of you in a trance. Anyways, let's head to the <clears throat> What the hell is that? What? Maybe smiles not the creepiest part of this video. Anyways, so to the- oh my- I actually almost just got flung. That would have been the worst moment of my life. Anyways, let's open this- oh. Oh! Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, it's so beautiful. I mean, just look how cool this rainbow portal looks. I mean, wow. Oh, it still looks exactly the same, but that's okay. Alright, we're in. Haven't been here for a while, but okay. Let's go here. Jump. Go to the left. Go here. No. Now, what was the code? If I get this correct, you gotta subscribe, okay? Two, six, eight, five. Enter! Now that's a little awkward, isn't it? Alright, after watching my tutorial, which you, which you should, by the way, we get two, four, eight, five. Yes, okay. If I'm not wrong, this area leads to a badge, but we need to get another badge first. This actually gives you a badge, you get this, you eat it, you, you can't eat it, but this gives you a badge, it's called Tuna, again I'll show it and put, what the, look at, anyways, um, so yeah, these, let's turn on audio, can't hear anything, come on, there's just very echoed footstep noises, alright, over here, now I don't know if you can see this, <coughs> okay, we made it, <laughs> not that noise, Wait, I've already got the badge that I need to get. Alright, cool. So let's go back and let's get the badge to end the video. And it all ends with my happy place. Okay. I'm not going to turn on audio. Because I like my ears. But yeah, this is a... Uh, it's... You know, it really is, you know, it really comes down to, like, interpretation. But yeah, whatever makes you happy, I guess. My friend actually said that to get the badge you have to wait, like, five to ten minutes. So, uh, see, see you then, I guess. I don't know. Telling me that I didn't even get the happy place badge. Are you for real? Yes, I am. Although I didn't get the happy place badge, we still found three badges in this video. And that's not even including Gek Tree, the Lecture badge in the eyes, and of course, the happy place badge. This isn't the end of the series, as I still have some badges to find. But until then, I'll keep searching for the badges, and I'll make a video once I've found some more. And so to everyone who's watched this video all the way to the very end, thank you.